Welcome, everybody, to the hottest wrestling program in the entire world. Welcome, everybody, to NXT. We've waited long enough. Let's get this thing started. Sit tight for... Now, don't go anywhere. We have a classic coming up. We have one of our breakout talents against an imposing adversary. I can't wait. He carries himself like a rock star and has many epic performances to his name already. It's time to experience the Velveteen Dream. Yeah, I'm ready. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. The Velveteen Dream oh, already has an iconic style, legion of fans, and multiple match of the year candidates. And the amazing thing is that the guy's only 23 years old. Now you can be sure that by the time the Velveteen Dream finishes performance, a heck of a lot of people are going to know his name. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. He's going to need to find a way to fire back. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. Oh, oh man! Guys, at the risk of sounding like an amateur psychologist, it seems pretty clear that Velveteen Dream absolutely thrives on attention. Nah, don't worry, you just sound like an amateur commentator. Gets out of the way of that one. Ooh. He's starting to feel it here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Well, I agree with Byron's statement that Velveteen Dream is an attention seeker. I mean, why else wear all the frilled shirts and jeweled outfits? Hmm, why else? How about because he's a fashion icon? Anyway, the only thing that matters is you, what you do in the ring. And let me tell you, Velveteen Dream can do pretty much anything. An easy kick out there. He isn't going to go away that easy. As we've seen countless times over the years, superstars oftentimes try to make a statement with their entrance. And I think it's safe to say that Velveteen Dream did just that, Byron, at NXT TakeOver Philadelphia. Yeah, and leave it to Velveteen Dream to bring out an entourage prior to one of the biggest matches of his career. Pile driver. Elaborate a little more on Velveteen Dream's takeover Philadelphia entrance you guys mentioned. For me, the best part was watching Dream have his customized map. Going for Asplex, man! He's back in control here. Digging deep for a kick out. The bruiserweight Pete Dunne still has some fight left, which means trouble for his opponent. Putting it all on the line. Here he goes. Ooh, this just might be enough for him. And here's a cover. Ripped out a two count. How in the world? 
Not so fast. Just shattering boot. He's making a statement here with this attack. Going for X Flex, man. I'm not sure how much he has left. And how they survived that is anyone's guess. Not yet. What a stop. Good grief. We've arrived. It's about time. You've got to believe this one's over. He's got him covered. The pinfall and the victory. These guys gave everyone their money's worth. Here's another look. Check this out. Still can't believe I get paid to watch this amazing action. Here is your winner, Pete Dunn. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. Now that matches any in the... When we return, it's a battle where the participants will need to know where they are at all times. We have a team led by one of the best talents on the roster today against TM61. I cannot wait. Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. Doesn't get any better than this. We're about to witness tag team action at its finest, fellas. And I can't help but wonder how the champ's game plan differs, if at all, knowing that the title is not on the line here tonight. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. That's how you wear down your opponent. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. Two superstars get In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team match when Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch squared off against... Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game-changer right there, Michael. Ooh, what a 
fired up. And the instinct from Fish on display. So quick. He's on the defensive here. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee could bring Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair back together. Natalia's power set the tone for the match and gave her team an advantage. That was until Carmella's overconfidence let the Irish last kicker turn the tie and get back into the match. And then it was elementary from there for the Irish born superstar. Naomi did an excellent job of making sure any quote unquote committee nonsense cost her girls the match. Once Becky Lynch got Carmella locked in the disarmor, there was nothing for the Staten Island Princess to do but to tap out. And it didn't take long for that to happen. sooner than later. This might be it! Oh, my! Kyle O'Reilly studying up! Uh-oh. Is he done? Whoa, he lets him out. What a fool. He had him dead to rights. Oh, he's such a tough target. In off the tag. Boom! Oh boy, he is winning. Look out, he's almost there. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. end of that stick. Too quick for him there. Nobody controls the pace of the match. What like the there it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Uh-oh. This is not the time to be a hero. To keep this match from slipping away, he needs to get his partner in there and take a break. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's looking at it. Oh, nasty impact. Now he's got to capitalize. Look out, that can break bones, guys. Great tag team match here tonight. I don't think the tag team scene has ever been hotter here in WWE. Oh! And Nick Miller too quick that time. Showing some quickness there. Tagged in. Toughen up. No, he reverses it. Harsh impact. Gets the tag. IQ 
can't believe everything that's transpired this far. It's been so physical. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Now it's Nick Miller. Thunderous slam. To think, I almost wrote him off. Whoa, down he goes. That was impressive, Cole. Let's take another look at these guys getting after it. Ain't nothing better than action like this. Here are your winners, Bobby Fish and Kyle O'Reilly. The Undisputed Era. What a back and forth battle that was. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're gonna follow that. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. Hold on to your seats. We have singles action coming up next. We have one of our breakout talents versus a formidable opponent. This is going to be amazing. days here in WWE saw her steamroll over nearly everybody she stepped into the ring with. Everybody except Kyrie Sane. Yeah, Bianca has been quite dominant since her start in WWE, but her first loss came in the Mae Young Classic to the eventual winner, Kyrie Sane. We mentioned Bianca Belair's loss to Kyrie Sane in the Mae Young Classic. Normally, a competitor, I knew it. Yeah, we knew this wasn't over. I've seen some unique offenses over the years, Byron, but perhaps the most unique thing I've ever seen is when Bianca whips her opponents with her own hair. I have never seen anything like it, Michael. But I'll tell you what, if I was to give advice to anyone facing Bianca, it would be to turn the tables against her. Go ahead and whip her with her own hair. Boom, what impact! To your point about Bianca's hair, Byron, I do think it's long enough that an opponent could likely use it as a weapon as well. Nope, that won't work. Grabbing an opponent's hair can lead to disqualification. Besides, everybody knows the best way to prevent Bianca from using her hair is to cut it off, a la Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Beautiful technique. <laughs> oh, man! She's starting to feel it. She's going to have to make sure this doesn't get out of hand. You know, she's the kind of competitor that actually likes getting hit. It motivates her. And this might just be what she needs to put her over the top, believe it or not. Well, she's looked good up until now. She just has to make sure not to absorb too much punishment here if she wants to get back into this thing. Oh, a shit breaker! Try walking after that one. She goes for the cover. And Sane gets the shoulder up. Uh-uh. Comes up big with the reversal. It's the tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. But if anybody could break free from this, it... Oh! Incredible. I don't know if Sane can recover. Probably not. Looks like trouble here, Byron. I don't know. I guess that all depends on who you're rooting for. Quick 
thinking to avoid that one. Nice job getting out of the way of that one. And she goes down hard. That'll leave a mark. You gotta believe this one's over. Oh man, she's rolling now. Ladies and gentlemen, by now I'm sure you've heard Bianca Belair describe herself as the EST of NXT. Corey, what exactly does that mean? I'll break it down for you, Michael Cole. It simply means that Bianca Belair is the strongest, the fastest, the smartest, and the baddest around. Beautiful drop kick. She's looking a little unsteady. At this point, you have to wonder if she can... She goes for the cover. She's still in it. She's still in this one. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. Kyrie Sane, big move coming. And she comes up short. If you're going to leave your feet, you got to make sure you're going to land the move. Oh, what a slam. Wow, what a move. Bianca Belair may have just ended this, fellas. Shoulders down, is it enough? She's got some fight left in her. How in the world? Oh, oh. this is what's this gonna be? Wheelbarrow! And face first! And the match continues. Oh, nasty impact. Oh, talk about getting flanked. Yeah, she's going to be feeling that one for a while. Jumping, leaping attack. This may very well be it. She's not done yet. She's still in this one. Keep your eye on this one. Look at this. Kyrie Sane. Big move. Ooh. I bet you feel foolish riding her off now. Gentlemen, I think Kyrie Sane may have just secured this match. And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Bianca Belair. Big move coming. Man, what a slam. He's back in full control now. She goes for the cover. One, two, three. Yes! Unreal performance. Let's take another look at these women in action. Look at her go. Remember this? And finally... Here is your winner, Bianca Belair. And that's a win to start off the night. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at...
Float over. Oh. And it was... Clean off your face. That was nowhere near a three count. Not yet. Too early. Vicious knee. He's taking some offense. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all-out battle. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. He seemed more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. What a stomp! Good grief! Toss to the outside. Soul kick takes him down in a major way, too. Give it the ring. And Oni Warkins slips out of harm's way. unusual matchup. Nah, not yet. Too early. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, what a German suplex. Harsh impact. Oh, what impact. Watch this. Oh, boom. what a suplex. He doesn't want to absorb much more punishment if he wants to win this match. This is one of the more evenly matched contests we've seen in quite some time. From the looks of things, it could really go well. I'm not sure how much he has left. He's in trouble. Nail it. This could be it, guys. Uh, this right here. This might be it. Oh, my. This one is. And here's another look at what made that match so special. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. Here is your winner, Adam. Kicking off the night with an impressive victory. If that's the type of action we're going to get all night long, I can't wait to see the rest of the card unfold. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action.
Something told me we might hear from him. He's a man on a mission. Here we go. Let's find out. With everything going on lately, we thought we might see him tonight. You know this guy came prepared. Let's see what he has to say. Respect the effort. Okay. Uh-oh. 
Somebody seems a little cocky. left with more questions than answers after that. As far as production values and message, I'm not sure what to make of that. I sure hope the match is more exciting than that promo.